think about cooking, probably cooking things which they might actually like, uh, instead of things that they just, you know, assume were healthy and you know, hopefully we can uh, you know, inspire some kids to, to eat healthy and start that lifestyle. Yeah, we've got four young ladies here today that uh, you're going to uh, we have, have yeah. in your kitchen and yeah. one of them is an aspiring um, chef, she, she, she is, is. Yes. Well, I bet she knows a lot more about food than I do and she, uh, she might be giving me some tips by the end of it. But, um, yeah, well, hopefully you should have a good time and, and just have a bit of a play around, have some fun, you know, nothing serious and just, just see what happens. I'm sure we'll botch it off when they're in some ways. And, uh, put a lot of time, you, you know, into it, it's trial and error with what you put in and, and what you like, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's, yeah. that's the fun thing for me about food is that, I, you know, I, I enjoy just, just trying different things and making mistakes as well. It's very much like on a rugby pitch, you make mistakes and you learn from those mistakes and you try and improve them. That's pretty much the same philosophy as my cooking. As we're cutting costs at Saints, we've only got one rolling pin, so <laughs> we'll have to take it in terms. Who wants to go first at rolling the door? Yeah, do you want to go for it? So just make, make it whatever shape, whatever shape you want. That's it, give it a good smear around with the back of the spoon. Just one, two, and... Uh... Two ladies, a bit more. Danielle and Gemma now just uh, putting the uh, tomato, tomato base, is it John, I'm sorry. Tomato, yeah, it's, yeah tomato all base. it is is, is uh, tomatoes cooked down with some onions, some garlic and then some fresh herbs, yeah. salt and pepper. Yeah. That's good, that's good. Right. I've got, a lot, I've got a lot of stuff to use here, so this... Looks like it's going to be a big pizza this, John. It could be, yeah, yeah. Pop out of pizza. Uh, one for uh, Mori Fasabalu to eat this on. <laughs> Anybody know what, what this is here? Anybody? Philadelphia. No, it's, it's mozzarella oh, cheese. cheese. Mozzarella cheese, nearly. You know when you bite into a pizza and it's all you've got stringy cheese that comes off, it's usually mozzarella, so do you want some uh, mozzarella? Uh, I have a dabble at that, Hannah, that looks good, yeah. Yeah, and then what I do is just spread it evenly, spread some bits evenly sure. around. Plenty of ingredients around the uh, sweet corn, the onion, and the, the tomatoes. I'd cook this after, you know, say, uh, this is not something I'd eat before a game or before training, but it's something I'd cook, you know, at home if I was just relaxing. And, you know, we have days where we have to eat things, you know, like this varied, you know, we have a varied diet, so certainly not something I'd eat before a match, but it's it's a healthy choice for a lot of people, really. It's, and it's, it's something that people are familiar with and don't understand that it can be healthy as well. Notable by his absence right yeah, about now, so um, yeah, he's, I he's think been he's here for about 100 years, hasn't he? Yeah, he's, he's, he's uh, <laughs> I think when the stadium gets knocked down, he's going with it, so he's, uh, <laughs> he's part of the furniture, is John. <laughs>
we made the base and we like crunched the edges and then we we went to the um, all the ingredients and we spread it um, some that sauce over it and then we picked just put all the ingredients on and put it in the